What's up you guys? What's poppin? It's your girl Abby Nick and today I'm back with another video. In today's video y'all, I'm coming to y'all with a shoe haul and kind of how I style it and put my little sauce onto it you guys. Y'all know I've been taking a big big break from YouTube and just social media in general. If you ain't know now you know by the way. And I just wanted to come with something different, a different setup, a different type of production. Um, and so on and so forth. I just did my hair and makeup and I just feel so fresh. I just wrote a freestyle to a whole lot of money by Bia. Shout out to Bia. I know y'all loving that song right now, but I've been on, you've been corned. I've been on that song before TikTok made it blow up. But anyway, in this video, I'm featuring five pair of shoes and five outfits for you guys just to see if you guys like these type of videos. I have bought so much shoes and also received so much shoes that I have to break these videos um, into different parts. So if you guys like this style of video, I'll continue to do it like this. If y'all don't, I'll probably just keep it um, at just strictly just the shoes and then we can go from there. But if you guys like this style of video, after you're done watching it, please let me know. Comment down below, like this video, and make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more. So if you guys wanna see this a shoe try on haul and how I style them, then please keep on watching. Okay. All right, so first and foremost, you guys, I just want to say that my style as a woman is always changing, especially because I moved out here to L.A. straight after living with my parents for, what, like right after high school, probably like a year and a half after high school. So I wasn't really able to dig in my inner grown woman self. I didn't even get to club while living um, in my parents' house for real. I didn't really get to go out and do grown woman things because I was still young. I moved out right at, right at um, 19, 18 going on 19. So, or was it 19 going on 20? I can't remember, but either way, I moved out still in my early age of where I didn't know what I liked or what I didn't like, okay? So now living in LA, I'm developing into my own woman, my own boss, you know what it is. And I'm just like really digging into my inner self. And last year, you know, I had like a couple heels here and there, basic closed toe shoe, but I have really, really, really been in to just stylish shoes and lace up heels, especially for the summer. You could never go wrong with a lace up heel. So I'm also getting into boots too, thigh highs, all that type of stuff. I know I'm late, but better late than never. So we just gonna get right into it and start with the first look that I put together for you guys. Some of these looks I might not be sure of, but again, I'm still growing and trying to decide and but me being an artist child, I just need a stylist at this point. But we're going to still try to style ourselves, okay? So without further ado, let's get started. First, we puff. <laughs> so I barely got any sleep last night. That's why my voice might sound a little raspy. But anyway, here we go. So the first shoes that I have here are these, you guys. And oh my gosh. These are so freaking cute. Let me like try to hold them like this way so you guys can see. What I really like about this shoe, like number one, is the shape. I love the triangle toe. Lately, I've been heavy on the square toe. Again, if y'all want to see my um, last shoe haul video I did, it's from Ego. I did all Ego shoes in that video. It'll be linked down below and in the eye in the corner somewhere on the screen. So definitely go check that out. But these are super cute. Now, all these shoes except for one, I did not get online. I bought these myself at the local stores here around here in LA. If I can find the stores, I will link them down below. If not, definitely check out Ego. I recommend them 1 million percent. Also, Public Desire and Simi Shoes to find kind of this type of vibe here. But anyway, these are like a mint green, y'all. And I'm just trying to have every color shoe because you never know what you're going to wear. And I'm always, always wearing um, black. So with me, you know, doing my little color series that I was doing, it pushed me to wear other colors. It pushed me to step out my box because if it was up to me, I'd wear black and white every day. Hence me wearing white right now. So anyway, love these shoes so much. These are not uh, really a, a lace up heel as far as like it being super strappy, but it crisscrosses right here. You guys seen the way I styled it. I just paired it with some jeans and um, a little crop top. If you want, I probably would do this instead too. I didn't try it on in the video, but I would do a skinny jean so you could see more of the shoe instead of just the um, bottom half of it. But I really, really love this color. They're comfortable. I am a size 10 in shoes, if you guys are wondering. Um, and yeah, these are from, it says Liliana on the brand, but I really believe that that's a wholesale maker. 
But these are so cute and I hope you guys could really see the color and how they're looking. But yeah, I wore these once already and they're already scuffed. Child, wearing your shoes out, it just be your mission. These I was really excited about getting and again, I've been pushing myself out of my comfort zone. This is the box that they came in. These are $40 and it says that it's a lemonade um, shoe. The brand is Lemonade Style Obsessed Nude. Now I believe that um, lemonade is like a wholesaler. So I don't think you guys will be able to go on there and find them. But like I said, keep checking your local stores. This right here. And let me know you guys with Abby Nicole Boutique. We are working on a lot of things. You guys know I'm on a little hiatus. But if you guys are opposed to me doing shoes like these on Abby Nicole Boutique, let me know because I will look into it for you guys. But anyway, um, yes, this shoe is so cute. I love the chunky jewelry it got going on because sometimes you just need a gold shoe. Love the um, square toe. That's what I'm really used to. When I um, went crazy on Ego, square toe was where it was at. So there's like a clear strap right here and then you're, it, it kind of holds on when your foot is in it. You'll see it on my foot, but it crosses over. Um, it has a clear strap, I guess, so that it could be a little bit more controlled with the chains and these are just so cute you guys see how i styled it it just gave me versace vibes it has a clear heel in the back these are pretty tall you guys i'm five nine but i don't let that stop me because i need to look the part and wear my heels and pop out okay so yeah these are those shoes love these two y'all know i love me some soles i'm playing for i bring them back okay all right y'all so these when i saw these I had to grab them. They had them in brown and nude as well. But y'all, y'all know that royal blue used to be my favorite color. But what's crazy is I never did anything in the royal blue series or never did a royal blue series because it was really hard for me to find royal blue clothing. So when I saw these, I'm like, I have to get these. Like, you don't get royal blue all the time. These are also in the brand Liliana. The thing that I like about these is that they're suede and they are meant to be like a ballerina tied up really high. In the um, clip, you guys see that I styled it with this blue set. But honestly, I could also style this with some shorts, a crop top, and tying these all the way up as high as I can for a really cute summer look as well. So again, these are just kind of roughly what I would wear or showing you a couple looks that I would do. But trust me, you can wear these so many different ways. And this one just has the one strap um, in the front as well. And then it crisscrosses right here and then you control the rest how high it goes if you want to keep it low or high but the straps are flat so it's just it's giving me a real real ballerina vibe that i fucks with okay you guys so this next shoe was definitely me stepping out my comfort zone a little bit it's the color block on here for me the heel on here is different for me and but it just it just screams summer this is my third pair of mules i have brown mules i have um some white ones and then i got these now these material are cloth, but I really, really, really like the fit. Like they feel really secure. Like some of my mules be feeling like my toes is finna slide out of them. And that's because there barely is an arch, but as you can see, even my hand can't get through to this. And the heel is like that um, weird shape that they got going on that I don't really care for this shape, but whatever. The yellow stitching is everything. This one's more predominantly pink on this side, and this one's more predominantly blue. And I just love this shoe. I just love this shoe. these with jeans and a tank top or a t-shirt, some sweats, um, pop of color. I just love them. I just love them. Like I said, the way I styled it in these video, in the video, was kind of like a rough. I could have definitely styled them different ways, but honestly, y'all, I need to get new clothes too. I'm getting all these shoes, but I'm new clothes, so don't mind me if the outfit's don't do it for you because I still got room to play. Okay. Alright you guys, so last but not least, I just want to say shout out to special somebody for buying these for me. These are from Ego. I'll link these down below. These are in the UK8. I'll let you guys know where I got these from because I know I got these from Ego. Um, someone gifted them to me though. But what I will say I don't like about this shoe is that it's super loose. I already have skinny feet as it is. And... The straps don't really do much for me. Maybe I have to like really go through and tighten it like from the bottom. But I do like the knots on them. It just gives the shoe a different type of vibe. It's giving me just knot vibes, like a naughty thing. You know what I'm saying? It also has that um, bottom like the other shoe, but a little bit more wider. 
but I needed me a pink shoe. And at the time, this was the only one I found. I also will show you guys my other shoes. Again, if you guys like this type of videos, I'll do a part two or um, a different type of video with my new. If you guys like these videos, I got more shoes right upstairs that I could show y'all. So just make sure you guys are coming down below so I could know. But yeah, these are super cute. Pair them with the blazer and the jean skirt that I got from Forever 21. And yeah, so that's pretty much it, you guys. I just wanted to keep it short and sweet. Five pair of shoes today. I promise you I have so much more. But I just wanted to see how you guys like this type of video. You know, it's a new addition to my channel. And um, no, it wasn't sponsored. So let me know what you guys think. I love you guys so, so much. Let me know what your favorite look or shoe was. Let me know what your type of shoe. Are you a wedge girl? Are you a mule girl? Are you a um, lace-up girl? Are you a platform girl? Whatever you are, comment down below so we can kind of chit-chat down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials. And that's pretty much it. Stay tuned for the new music. I be next year. You already know what it is. Love you guys. Mwah. Bye.